Hi, I'm Tom and welcome. In this video, I'll go over the control group spill setup and how this can be utilized to speed up your workflow on the S series. Along with the set spill option, the S series really does provide one of the fastest interfaces in the 96K small format console market. First of all, let's navigate to control group solo button control as shown. Select solo and spill members. This mode will bring to the surface the first 10 members of a control group when soloed. In preferences, select which screen the control group spilled members will appear. On the S21, assign to screen 1. On the S31, look to assign on screen 1 or 2. Let's now look at the exciting workflow for this setup. Add some channels into a control group. For example, label the control group drums, then add in all your drum mic channels. If adding more than 10 channels to a control group, select Spill Selection, as shown. This allows you to choose the 10 channels to appear. Next, access the Overview window. Activate Edit and select Set Master. Choose the bank of control groups. Come out of the Overview. The control group bank is now locked to the right-hand screen, as can be seen. To instantly display channels assigned to your drum group, simply press the Solo button. Notice how all the channels now appear on the left hand side screen. I can now affect faders, parameters immediately and return to my previous view by pressing the solo button again. To further enhance your view, consider replacing the top bank on the left hand side screen with something important, such as aux outputs or a custom bank. The added benefit of the spill set function adds even more control with just one button press. Up to 10 custom channels will appear when spill set is activated. That's it. It really is that quick to set up and utilize the quickest interface in the market. Thanks for listening and check out more of my videos on how to set up your S-Series console of choice.